You know, they say that there's treasure at the end of a rainbow. And we're headed towards treasure. Not today. So we went flea market shopping earlier and we couldn't find anything that was, you know, worth a damn. So I was about to just throw in the towel, call it a weekend, but uh, I came across an offer I can't really turn down. It's a vehicle that I've wanted since I was, I was probably three or four years old when I first started talking about them. And uh, it's just, it's an insane day for me personally. And I'm really excited to share it with you guys. So I think it's going to be, it's going to be awesome. You heard what I said, I say it yeah. Oh no, 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 no Oh no, 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 no This is why you don't speed when you're going to get a new car I'm telling you right now, Jerry Ray of Greene County, Sheriff You're the nicest man I've ever met in my life And thank you for not giving me a ticket It means a lot more to me than you will ever know God been a minute since I seen this man, what's Cody up? Nunn. What's yeah, up? Yeah, you're bigger than ever. This is, uh, you know, the first thing I ever learned how to drive right here. So be nice to her, treat her well. Oh, it's just take a, care. It's a classic. Yeah, it is. Oh man, don't break it. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh my God. Have fun with her. Take care of with her. You know, keep me updated. You know, check in every now and then. <laughs> so I can't, I can't really make a video while I'm in this driving because. The brakes don't really work. The e-brake for sure doesn't work. And I don't know that it'll go over 50 miles an hour. And the low beams are out. It only has high beams. The bleeder valves are broken off in the calipers. But I got an AM radio, a glove box, and a couple of seats. So we're pretty much golden. I got good news. The brakes, the brakes work. You just gotta pump them like 36 times and then they lock right up. Oh, Jesus. You know what though, I couldn't have picked a better person to buy a car from. Cody Nunn, he's a large man with a larger heart. So I wanna shout Mr. Nunn out to the Facebook world for being so cool, so nice, and selling me this very well operating vehicle. You know, it's a heavily optioned car. You got a couple things in her trick, one of which is the key. I mean, you don't really need to do much there. The worst part about this whole purchase and this stupid ass idea was my truck following me home with its regular headlights blinding the absolute stuff out of my face. I can't cuss, and all I wanna do is cuss so loud right now because I can't see. My retinas are burned out of the back of my skull. Stupid ass, dumb truck. Just watch what happens when I adjust my mirror. Ah! Ah! Oh! Oh, ah, oh, God, stupid, man. Any of you Power Stroke guys that put 37 LED bars on the front of your truck can eat a giant fat can of ravioli. There's one thing that I know I can get in, cut the key on, it'll always get me to where I need to go. It is 110%. My 1992 Ford Festival. I mean, you can't play with that. You can't play with the, uh, I don't even think it has a brand name, the classics? You can't play with those. Patina, lock, rust, the little, oh, it's a lot. It's not. High option vehicle, uh, stain guard, uh, window operator. Uh, does it have door locks? They lock. Uh, this this is an aftermarket piece. This is just high dollar cup holder. It's rubber too, so if you're you know hitting the trails. Uh, super option dash. Oh my God! What does that button do? Oh, it's got to be the AC, I would assume. And if you're feeling lucky. You know, God, what a wonderful purchase. I already broke the horn. Oh, come on, it's like my favorite part of every car. I like to honk the horn along the tune of songs while I'm on the highway because nobody cares if you're honking your horn on the highway. 
and now I lost my horn ability. It's okay, it's still a win. We still got a win, it's in the win column still. So we made it home with the Festival. It made it one piece. We got some brakes to address. We got a little uh, rust to address and a couple of little things. And then I think I'm gonna cut the roof off of it. Make me a nice roadster. Still up in the air, but if you can, like and share, subscribe to my YouTube, high five me in the hallways because nobody else in high school ever did.